Hello, my name is Scott for SB Gaming and welcome back to Transport Fever. We're here on the Panama mission. This is the third mission of the American campaign. And we are building the Panama Canal, or at least digging this part out. This is kind of an abstracted version of Panama. We got the Atlantic Ocean over here. Pacific Ocean over here, at least I think that's the oceans. We have this river here, and this is apparently, yeah, part of the Panama Canal. As we start producing stone, this will dig out. But uh, we have our first train going to be leaving the station. Oh yeah, indeed. And what I would like to do, for now we are just going to set this to full load any. Let's go full load all. just until this thing gets producing and we'll just keep that on the screen just because reasons there we go the train is filling up with stone and now I want to send this like that When you're laying down double track, it's pretty cheap because you don't really have a whole lot of train to move now. What I would like to do is I want to run this one into here. And the reason for that is I want the trains coming into the station to not have to slow down. Whereas the ones leaving the station, they can kind of make the S-curve. There we go. Now signals, throw a signal there, signal there. And so we've produced 29 of 5,000 stone. Just throw down some signals every once in a while. Make sure you put the signal on the right side of the track of whichever direction you want the train to go. So with this side, to go that way. A lot of people seem to have a lot of issues understanding signals, but they're not that difficult to understand. When you understand the right side is the right side. <laughs> uh, we'll throw yeah, two more there. And now I want the signal to be on this side so that it can allow that. All right. Now we have some decent stone coming in. So what we are going to do is we are going to set this to load if available. Get that moving. And this will, of course, ramp up. I think we need to get this up to a limit of 400. It might be 800 before we can get the uh, was it landslide one here? Increase the maximum production of the quarry fourfold. So yeah, about that. Anyway, the chance of survival for the golden frog is 55% and rising. We put down a ton of trees in here, over there, over there, and over there. That should be good enough. 
I don't suspect we are going to need much more than that. And now what I'd like to do is buy another Atlantic and we want to throw in... Good gracious, we're spending money like there's no tomorrow. Just this once, our financial backers are willing to turn a blind eye and help <laughs> us out once again. But this is definitely the last time. All right, so we got four wagons on there. And when we take a look at this, that pays us 424,000. Speed it up. And that was not a full wagon, so we have five wagons. And yet, when this is at its maximum production for, I think, a couple months, it schedules an upgrade. It's going to be fairly easy to get this to upgrade. And we got 48 coal. Or no, stone. Alright, so yeah, we're going to have to wait until... Let's new line this here all the way over to here. And then this is going to be TF Dam West. Let's go back to the station. We have 32 for Dam East, nothing for Dam West. There we go. This upgrades in one month. There we go. It has a production limit of 200. That's not going to be a problem. This will start increasing. And we're still not at full capacity for the wagons that we have. That's fine. We have removed 155 of 5,000 stone. We've delivered 88 to the dam east, nothing yet to the dam west. Did it? Or wait a minute. Oh no. It didn't. That's right. It wasn't producing here. Now, we have not removed enough stone for it to show any progress. And we have 134 of 1,000 progress for that dam over there. It'll be the fastest one to get done. This mission is pretty much all about brute forcing it. There we go. Grabbing all that. Let's jump aboard and ride the stone train. Was not the train I wanted to uh, ride. And I just want to check what is the payout for 31 stone? 894,000. Let's ride the train back. Ooh. For Panama North. <laughs> yeah, 
it's a little bit of a roller coaster. Five million, one point oh five million in the bank, one point six three. I just want to grab that train if I can. Can I? There we go. All right. Well, what I'd like to do is change this to red. Doing for the chance survival, 62% and rising. We have delivered planks to the swamp number three. We have six of ten and four of ten to the other two swamps. Uh, this is swamp number two, and this is swamp number one. Yeah, these basically will get taken care of. Seven, eight, nine, and one more. There we go. So all we need is another six being delivered here. And that'll be taken care of. And we have some progress on the canal. Three point oh three million in the bank. What we're going to do is buy another train. We're going to buy an Atlantic, and we are going to buy a couple gondolas. We want to put at least four on each. End of the line. It's no use begging and pleading. Our financiers are refusing to put even <laughs> one more penny into our project. That Dead. is not a problem. We have received additional funds and should use it to hire more people. We can hire a bunch of islanders from the Caribbean. They toil like crazy, and that for only a handful of silver coins. That would certainly increase our profit margin. Or we can pay a few engineers in expensive gold coins to supervise the work and to ensure that things aren't constantly breaking down. That should have a positive impact on our operating costs. All right, well, we have the option, either plus 10% vehicle revenue or plus 10%, or minus 10% actual vehicle operating costs. We can check here and the income railroad currently, or last year we made $3.33 million. This will of course ramp up. And we had running costs of 1.43 million. So we can either save 10% on this or get 10% on this. Obviously, if you're paying attention, getting the income is a whole lot better. If you're losing money, obviously the, getting the running costs cut down a bit is the better deal. But I think we're going to go with the silver coins plus 10% vehicle revenue. I think I went with this just because I really didn't need the money, just because it's pretty easy to make money as it is. So... We're going to go with vehicle revenue. And actually this is also road vehicle. Which we're currently making 334 from. And that's gone up a bit. Whereas operating costs of roads are 95.7. Yeah, yeah, let's go with vehicle revenue. Now, question is, have we gotten anything of this? Nope. That's fine. Yeah. 
And as you can see, the other gondola that we had is no longer available. So we cannot buy it. 1.46 million. We are going to dump this on the dam west line. Right now we have 90, over 100 going to dam west and 353 dam east. We are 35% of the way for that, so we don't have to really worry about that too much. We could brute force this and then send all the other trucks or trains on the other line. But I'd rather have them going to both. Either way, it doesn't really matter. Now, one thing I'm going to want to do is haul stone over here. What I'm going to do is build a freight depot. One station. One platform, and we are going to want to have this go some like there. We are not going to use it right away, but uh, we will need it eventually. There we go. Let's double track it. No, I'm not going to double track from the bridge. Or I'm not going to double track the bridge. Now we are going to want to have this. Like that. into there. Now I'm going to signal there. Put a signal there and there. There and there. And just one more right there. Drain the swamp. All right. Got that taken care of. Chance of survival, 68% and rising. We have 203 going to the dam west, 462 at the dam east. With $2.65 million, so that means it is time to buy another train. Because we don't want to have more than $10 million in the bank. Let's buy gondola. Where's my third train? Trade one, train two. The other train's all the way over there, I think. Oh, there we go. Let's put train three there. And we got one million dollars. See how easy it is to make money in this game? Let's go damn west since we need to pick up the progress on that. How are we doing for stone? We have 125 going to damn east, only 41 going to damn west. We're probably going to want to have another train on damn east just to use up that stone. Although, with that said, hopefully, this should balance out so that. Most of the stone starts going over to Dam West, as it looks like it is, potentially. Upgrade scheduled in one month. We're at a limit of 400. And this is the, of course, brute force method. Landslide, if you dig too deep quickly. Yes, indeed. So you just have to get up to a limit of 800. 
Working towards that, 71%, that should be not a problem. This, as long as we don't have more than 10 million in the bank, that's fine. We have 15 years for Pride of the Nation, and this is just one that wraps things up. We are going to buy another train, or at least get ready to buy a train. We're going to buy an Atlantic, and another couple gondolas. Money? Anyone got money? Let's throw the train. F really, train five. Where's train four? One point three six million. Nice. All right. Well, we are going to set this to damn west. Four, where are you? And now we have three hundred ninety at Dam West, five hundred eighty two at Dam East. That's the thing you really don't need more than one train on the damn east. Although I don't like the fact that it was dumping a lot of stuff at damn east. On the damn east line. These are each carrying 48, so that's fine. 1.52 million. What we're going to do is get ready to buy another train. It's the brute force method for a reason. And anyone dropping off any... There we go. Nope. There. No, we don't. Alright, we have Dam West. There we go. Gondolas. And when's the next train coming in? There we go, 1.5 million. Um, yeah. Damn West. Alright, so we have... Where is that train? Train 6. Five trains going to Dam West. One train going to Dam East. We're 70% of the way through Dam East. We have 1,600 of 5,000 stone removed. We have 1.08 million, so I might as well get ready to buy another locomotive. Although, we'll just buy some gondolas. Use up our extra money that way. Money. 1.52 million. That's good enough. And now, how are we for the canal? Nice. Buy 
by train. We're gonna wanna put in the Atlantic. Ooh, 2.94. Oh, no, 2.94K. Point five three million. There we go. Now we're gonna send this to actually first. Let's pop it open so I can follow it. And we are gonna send it to Dam West. We got six trains going to Dam West. Dam East is still getting 156 stone, even though I have like six trains now on Dam West. What I'm just going to do is just start buying uh, boxcars, or not boxcars, gondolas. We'll just buy extra gondolas. And we're up to 774 units at Dam West, 762 at Dam East. Another million and a half. probably start doing is throwing these onto our existing trains. So this here, I'm going to send it back to the depot. And we are going to move two of those. We are going to send this back to two I think damn west. Yep. What's the next train to come? This one here. Send it back to the depot. more to that. We're going to send this to Dam West. Although what I'm going to do is I'm going to have it go back to the depot. I'm going to have this one, which is Dam East. Or Dam... Um, actually, no. That one's fine. We're going to have this go back to Dam West. train. We want to send this back to the depot. And I am going to be buying another Atlantic. And a couple of gondolas. We're going to move actually By trains, we're going to buy a couple more gondolas. We're going to send this to Dam West. Same thing with that.
it's the brute force method for a reason. And then we have that train. There we go. <laughs> and that's the progress of the canal. It would be nice if these things were actually moving, animated. Now the question is, yeah, I'm gonna have a backlog of trains. Two point one seven million. You have only four cars, so we're gonna send you back to the depot. I need you to go back. And then you are going to reverse. And now we're going to buy a couple more gondolas and you were on damn west anyway at this point in time what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a break here we are brute forcing our way through the canal we are about halfway through the canal 2421 of 5000 we have a fair chunk of resources waiting for us, although for some reason, it's just dumping all the stone. It should not see more than 118 units of demand for that dam over there. <laughs> anyway, thank you for joining me for this episode of Transport Fever, the Panama mission. Thank you for watching. My name is Scott for SB Gaming, and as always, have a good day.